book is presented to give you a quick, sketchy preview of the interesting things you'll see on your vacation here. Attractions for tourists are unlimited. Here you'll find charm, beauty, and good taste evident everywhere. Off in a cloud of dust, we find Joe Tourist on his way to vacation land. Speeding over valleys and mountains, he travels on. While Joe Tourist is traveling, we stop to marvel at the great majestic falls. Nearly twice as high as Niagara, the water plunges over the cliff in a spectacular 3,000 foot drop. In the vast ranges of the highland pastures, we come across a picturesque sheep herder returning from the summer grazing grounds. I say there, my good man, how do you like sheep herding? Huh? I say, how do you like sheep herding? Oh, it ain't so bad. Rising 6,000 feet above the floor of the valley, we come upon a scene of unsurpassed beauty and grandeur the towering snow-capped mountains. Hi, Peak. Hi, Sierras. Skiing, the most thrilling of all winter sports. Viewed against its background of towering mountain peaks, we find skiers' paradise. Amidst the sparkling white snowflakes, the valley is transformed into a fairyland of unforgettable charm. in a cloud of dust, Joe Tourist is still on his way. Now's your chance, Joe. Well, back to the mountains. Here we find some comfortable sleeping cabins. Due to the cool, dry climate, visitors are amazed at the absence of flies and mosquitoes. of the cabins, we find a product of higher civilization. Big Chief Running Water dictating a letter to his secretary. Uh. In some parts of vacation land, the sun shines with merciless intensity. Greatly affected by the heat beneath the sweltering rays, we find two perspiring gazunker birds. Now you fan me. And here's the mansion lodge located at an elevation of 6,000 feet. Well, uh, uh, that is an elevation of 5,000 feet. We find it conveniently located only a stone's throw from the beach. Let's visit the beach and enjoy the feel of the warm sand beneath our feet. Let's say hello to Dr. Sunshine. Keeping a watchful eye over all, we find our fine-feathered friend, the seagull. <whistles> Waiting for a bite at Fisherman's Pier. Well, these rod and reel enthusiasts have plenty of patience. Just one minute, boys. Off in a cloud of dust, Joe Tourist is still on his way. Okay, Joe, now's your chance. <laughs> Yeah. 
Beneath mountains of scenic beauty, we visit Citrus County, the land of plenty. 6,500 acres of colorful orange groves. Surrounded by the surpassingly beautiful fruit, we find Mr. Lurk, an ardent admirer. Dust, Joe Tourist travels on. And now, with deep regret, we bid farewell to Vacation Land, a world of romance and unforgettable charm. In the cool of the evening, amidst the sparkling jewels of the Pacific, the hot, burning tonic sun silently sinks beyond the horizon.